Chris Olivo. I'm a project manager for Mascaro Construction. Um, I chose the construction profession and industry, I think primarily because I always enjoyed being outside. You know, I was always the outdoor type of person. Um, you know, growing up, I was very involved in sports. So I think it was pretty interesting to find a, a career path that offered that same type of camaraderie and teamwork, um, and specifically here at Mascara too, more so I think than anywhere else. So throughout high school, I worked construction jobs in the summer. I uh, labored, I waterproofed housing foundations. I did a whole bunch of different um, jobs just to get exposure to the industry. Uh, when it came time for college, I went to the University of Dayton. Um, I studied civil and environmental engineering there. And then throughout the summers, while there, I was able to, and fortunate enough to intern with Mascaro, which ultimately when I graduated, I was hired as a project engineer. Um, now I'm a project manager. So when people ask what do project managers do um, and what the differences are, I think the best way to describe it is when you're a project manager, say you have a job that's um, a year long, 12 months, and it costs $10 million to, to, to construct it, you're running that, that's a small business. You're running a business for 12 months. It's a $10 million business. There's endless opportunities in this industry and also room for career growth. And I'd say there's such a, a wide range of career paths available. Um, you know, what's really you know, comforting and interesting to know is you can get into this industry not knowing 100% what you want to do yet, but because it covers such a wide range and selection of job types, descriptions, different abilities and skills. Um, you know, I'm, I'm very confident in saying that you can get into construction, um, find something that you love to do, and then progress and, and work your way um, up for whatever you want to do. No, I'd say it may be a challenge for people who are looking um, to get into the industry. I think a lot of uh, people or, or new employees feel intimidated a lot of times. Um, just the en entry into the industry, you're often working with, um, you know, guys or girls who are, you know, two, three times your age or have double the amount of field experience as you. And a lot of times um, you think you couldn't possibly offer anything or you're timid. And, and you know, I would say everyone in, the, in this industry is, is here to help. You know, if you ask questions and, and you put yourself out there and you're engaged and you want to learn, uh, you're going to find a, a lot of success here because we're all we're all here to help and and uh, you know make this the, the best experience for everyone possible.